Mauricio Pochettino will certainly like what he saw from the Chelsea team in their final game before next weekend's EFL Cup final. Taking on the tricky task of Manchester City away from home, the Blues were just minutes away from achieving what would have been an unbelievable victory at the Etihad. However, they had to settle for a 1-1 draw, although their defensive display brought back a lot of confidence in the team that had been absent in recent months. Pochettino made just one change that was not applied to his team compared to the one that started the two-half game against Crystal Palace. Raheem Sterling, who had not scored for a long time, was brought in in place of Noni Maduk and repaid the manager's faith in him with a first-half goal against his former team. It has certainly not been an easy start to life at Stamford Bridge since his £50 million move in 2022, although many know he has the ability to be a star player. His performance against City will put him firmly at the forefront of Pochettino's thinking as he looks to pick his team to face Liverpool in the EFL Cup final later this week. The Argentine was hoping to bring on Christopher Nkunku from the start at Wembley, having eased him in slowly in recent weeks to try not to cause another injury. Now, however, it is difficult to see where the Frenchman comes in, with limited attacking locations in the current system. Cole Palmer will likely be the first name on the team sheet when the game arrives, while Nicholas Jackson has done his best to prove that he should also be a starter due to his ability to bring his teammates into the game. And now Chelsea fan I want T.O. hear from you. What is your opinion about this? Put your opinion in the comments, I don't know if you know, but your opinion is very important for Chelsea at any moment I'll be back with more news from Chelsea.